Hey everybody, today we're going to show you some of the best ninja defuse spots here on the Modern Warfare 3 map underpass. So without further ado, let's jump into it. So we're going to start off with the A-bomb and the first spot is actually going to be outside the building. You can put down a tactical camera if you want, however, you don't necessarily need one. And all we're going to do is come right over here in this corner. Now, this is a very uncommon corner to be checked. Most players that are running through here are immediately looking up towards the middle of the map. So you're generally going to be really safe over here. It doesn't really matter where you lay down, but I recommend getting as far into the corner as you can and just slowly turning left so that you can kind of hide within this plant. If you scoot up just a little bit, you can, you'll can you have a couple blades of grass that make it a little difficult to see the bomb. But for the most part, you have a great view of it. You don't need a camera. You can just lay here, wait for the players to rush by. And as soon as they go for the plant, you can just sneak in behind them and get yourself a pretty easy ninja defuse here at A. Our second spot for A is going to be the only one that's inside of the building. I think it's the best place to hide. However, you are going to need a tactical camera to be able to see the bomb as we don't have a direct line of sight. So you go ahead and throw that down somewhere that has a decent view of the bomb. And all we're going to do is come over here behind the staircase and we're going to lay down in this box. So once you lay down, we're just going to try to slowly turn to the left here to put our legs in the box behind us. And it seems pretty obvious here. We can pull out our camera and watch the bomb from this location. But because there's a box under that staircase there, it makes it really difficult to see you from anyone coming in the front door. So you can just lay right behind that box. Anyone that's coming in here anyways is going to be checking this corner, potentially this back corner and anywhere up top. The only way you get spotted is if somebody runs all the way back around and is looking for you. Even if somebody does hit the flank, you can see it's pretty much impossible to see it behind those stairs there. And no one's really going to be checking it down there anyways. Even if you wrap all the way around up top, you can still see that it's really, really difficult to see if someone's laying behind that box. So really good spot and really, really close to the bomb to be able to pop up quickly and run over to get the ninja defuse. Our third and final spot for A is gonna be outside the building as well. So we're gonna need a tactical camera down to watch the bomb. What you wanna do is make your way up the stairs and come out this back set of double doors. Now it's important that you have one of these open. So when you come down from the defensive spawn, what you can do is just bust through both of them or bust through one, and then immediately come over here behind these barrels and just lay down. From here, you can pull out your tactical camera and watch the bomb. This spot isn't gonna be checked generally at all, uh, but for the most part, no one's gonna come out here before planting the bomb anyways. Uh, so you can watch your camera from here, you'll be safe. Anyone flanking from the spawn, you'll be good. Uh, and the reason you want one of these doors open is so that you can run through without making any noise and get yourself a defuse. Because if they're not open, you're either going to make noise or you're going to kill a lot of time running all the way around the edge to get inside. So uh, this is going to be our third spot for A. Now heading over to B, we're going to use a camera for pretty much every spot over here. Is there's not too many really good hiding spots where you have a direct line of sight to the bomb. So you go ahead and throw your camera down somewhere that can watch the bomb itself. The first spot we're going to go to is a pretty common one to hide in after the bomb is already down, and that's going to be in this room here behind the forklift. So all you really need to do here is lay down. You can put the back half of your body into the wall. It seems pretty obvious. It's not the most uncommon spot. A lot of players generally come here, but not until after the bomb is down. A lot of times you'll catch people planting the bomb and immediately rushing back here. But people checking this before putting the bomb down is pretty uncommon. So you can go ahead and lay back here, watch the camera and wait. And you're really close by. So you can just sneak up behind them and get the ninja defuse uh, before they even know what happened. So that's going to be our first spot here at B. Now, our second spot for B is also going to require a camera. So go ahead and throw that down somewhere that can see the bomb. This one's a little bit more tricky to get into as it's on the enemy side of B here. Uh, essentially, the spot is right over here in this back corner. However, there's a couple ways you can go about getting here. One is you can try to just rush it and hope that nobody rushes the right side and you can get back here without anybody seeing you. Or you can play it slow and just take your time, wait until you see that there's no one here and then just sneak your way across. But really all you want to do is lay in the grass back here. Now, it's a very common spot to hide in after the bomb's already down. A lot of times you'll catch players planning it and heading over this direction, just watching the flank. However, off spawn, most players coming through aren't really going to be checking this back corner. If anything, the closest they're going to get is behind this car. So you've got a really good spot to keep an eye on things, and you'll be able to tell when people are crossing. You don't really have to have your camera out the whole time. You can just wait until somebody runs by. Uh, but a really easy spot to hide in and then be able to sneak up behind somebody as soon as they go for the plant. So this is our second spot for B. Our third spot for B is another pretty common spot, but should be able to work well as long as you don't start peeking. Uh, you're going to need the camera, so go ahead and throw down the camera somewhere to watch the bomb. And all we're going to do is come over here behind this dumpster. Now, like I said, this is a really common spot for people to hide and just watch B. 
But as long as you don't peek this and players check it and don't see you standing up, you should be safe here. A lot of the times players won't come back here until again after the bomb is already down. But for the most part, all these spots that I'm showing you are places that players go after they get the bomb down. But right over here behind the dumpster, a really, really good spot to just watch the camera and keep an eye out for things. Uh, if you do see somebody sneaking around, this is what's great about the camera. If someone's not going for the plant and is trying to sneak back this way, you can get out from the camera and take that guy out. But again, a pretty nice spot, really close to the bomb. As soon as somebody goes for the plant, you can sneak up behind them. Get yourself an easy ninja defuse here. Our fourth and final spot for B is again, another one that's only going to work if you don't peek. So we can go ahead and throw down our camera somewhere to watch the bomb. And all we're gonna do is come up top right here, which is a really popular spot for the defensive side to head glitch and watch the enemy spawn. However, instead of peeking this, we're immediately going to lay down and just hide right over here on the edge of these boxes. You can slowly turn to put the back half of your body into these sandbags here. But yeah, we're just gonna slowly turn right here. As long as you don't peek, players that are checking this aren't gonna think anyone's up here. They'll feel safe and they'll try to go for the plant. And as soon as they do, you can watch your camera sneak up behind them. Again, if you do start to peek this though, you know, if you do show yourself and they do see you, they aren't going to put that bomb down until they check this and make sure that you're not here anymore. So don't peek it, stay laying down. What's even kind of nice is you can see here, you can almost see through this. So if you don't even want to put your legs in the sandbag, you can try to just watch through this and see when players come running through, just to give yourself a little heads up. But again, a really, really good spot. Players aren't going to check this generally until after the bomb is down or if you're just head glitching it and trying to shoot them as they run over here. But another pretty easy spot to get a ninja defuse here at B. But these are my favorite ninja defuse spots here on Underpass. As always, if you have some spots of your own that you really enjoy using, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below. I appreciate you guys watching the video and we'll see you in the next one.